Hello again YouTube and welcome back to my channel. In this video I show you a trick I've been using for years every time I get a flat tire on my bike. Alright, let's get into it. Alright, so the first thing you're going to need is a flat tire. You're going to need a pump to fill up your new tube. You'll need a replacement tube, something to get the tire off, and some scissors. All right, so let's get that tire off. One, two. This bike uses a coaster brake, so make sure you remove that if uh, your bike has a coaster brake. All right. You can use levers if you have to. Uh, I don't need to in this case, but if your tire is different or smaller, road bike something, you might want to use levers, so... Alright, so we're going to pull the tube out. Alright, now we're going to take our old tube. What I always do is I... I always cut it right at the valve stem. Split the tube in half. So I go along the seam here, take my scissors, and I just cut and I follow that seam all the way around. So let's do that. Alright, so not all tubes are going to have seams directly in the center like this one. Sometimes you have to run it in between two seams, but just find the center and cut it down the middle. We split our tube, and what I do with the replacement tube is I like to keep it a little bit aired up for this next step. So we're going to remove some air, but still keep a little bit of air inside of it. And we're going to take where our old valve stem used to be, where our new valve stem is. We're going to wrap it. We're just going to lay it down on the ground so that we make sure we get it wrapped nice and evenly. Right. So we've got it wrapped up. I usually like to take the tire off and set the tube inside of the tire this making sure it still stays wrapped around the old tube always check to make sure you don't have anything in the tire I neglected to mention that in the video but always check the tire as well now that we've got it all in here go ahead and let the air out We get our rotation correct on our tires. Just set it back in. Alright, here we go. Now we can pump up our tube. Alright, we've come to the end of the video now. Like I said, I've been using this technique for years and I hardly ever get flats. So hopefully you guys found that enjoyable. If you did, I ask that you go down, smash that like button, subscribe for more videos, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.